Hi folks, Steve here at Voss Wheelers. Today we're going to take a closer look at the Venture RV Sport Track Touring Edition 333 VRL Real Living Room. It's actually a switch from the front living rooms. Beautiful trailer, 36 foot 11 inch overall length. It weighs 8,090 uh, pounds. Uh, lots of features, so let's not waste any time and get going. At the front, electric tongue jack, LED lights with an adjustable foot pad. We have a one piece fiberglass cap that's painted and gel coated. It's also rock guarded. They had it the uh, radius window that's automotive style. It's glued in place and it comes with LED lights. Beautiful unit. Um, we have a fully enclosed underbelly and heated as well. There's actually ground effect, blue LED ground effect lights underneath there. Our storage compartment comes with a slam latch and magnetic holder, pass through. Also comes with a motion detector light and a battery disconnect. Right here in the corner, a connection for a solar panel. All four jacks on this unit are electric. They come with their individual motor and switch. And here for the front and two more in the back. 20 foot uh, electric awning with LED lights on the roller tube so you can change the inclination of the lights. It's kind of nice. Frameless, dark tinted windows, outside speakers, rain gutters with spout extension. They actually put a rain gutter over top of their slide outs as well. Nice touch. New step this year, folds flat in between the door frame. Big fold away hand free handle. Aluminum wheel, radial tires, nitro field. Double wiper seals on the slide out. There's another one right behind here. This little bulb is not a stick and peel, it's actually uh, set in a groove. It's not going anywhere, folks. Uh, top quality. In the back, Two hundred pounds uh, flip-up cargo tray, roof ladder. You got a dock for a backup camera already installed. You got cable satellite ready, and on this side, which we're not going to go, you also get an outside uh, shower. You get a black tank flush. You get a detachable power cord. It's fifty amps. You'll know why on the inside. And there's a couple of more things, but let's just take a look inside. There's also a light underneath the steps, folks, and also a patio light, amber, it's all LED. Talking about LED lights, all interior lights are LEDs as well. Let's start in the back. This floor plan, just like the front living room, they use a little half wall, it's kind of nice. People really, really like that. It separates the kitchen from the living space. And uh, they put a few doors so you can use it for storage. It's a, it's a nice little trailer. It's a very social trailer. You can be having some friends here, having the, uh, a cup of coffee, and then you can have a couple more playing cards, and you can all be part of the same conversation. It's kind of nice. Uh, theater seating. It reclines. The storage. Cup holders. Three windows. They all open up. Back wall is our enter entertainment system. 39-inch flat screen TV. AM, FM, CD, DVD, Bluetooth, USB. Uh, auxiliary and NFC, a fireplace that produces heat, plenty of storage, a couple of lights that let the lights in, I'm a big fan. Uh, the sofa is a threefold sofa, the best sleeping arrangement on a sofa since the invention of a trailer. Kitchen wise, pantry with adjustable shelf, you can add some, you can remove some if you want. Large incubate feet fridge. Stainless steel front that's going to match the microwave as well as the oven. We have a bifold flush mounted stove top. Very nice. There's even an igniter on it, folks. You don't need the lighter. Range hood vented outside. Mmm. You would say, why would the range hood be vented outside? Well, there's lots of manufacturers that are using a range hood that just circulates the air inside. So this is vented outside. Uh, hard surface countertop. Outer mounted. Uh, stainless steels, they're very deep as well. Pull out tap. It does come with a couple of sink covers, we just haven't installed them yet. Plenty of storage above. Even the shelves are in there already. Same below. Uh, plywood main drawers. Ball bearing hardware to hold drawer extend. I'm a big fan. Freestanding table and chair with storage underneath the uh, cushion chair. There's a skylight with a blind as well. 
And talking about blinds, it's all three to shade throughout. Very nice. Uh, going towards the bathroom, we have our, our control here. So slide out motors, uh, awning buttons, your lights on the awning on the inside as well, and your um, and your thermostat for the AC and the heat. Bathroom, a little smaller, but it's more than adequate. Porcelain foot flush toilets, a little cabinet for storage above. A very decent sized vanity, there's enough room to leave your toothbrush on there. God, there are some trailers that the vanity is, can't, can't leave a cup. You know, medicine cabinet, storage below. We have our water tank monitor as well as our water heater buttons and your water pump buttons. 36 by 30 shower folks that is better than the 36 by 36 rounder you got more room in here and I'm 5 8 and there's plenty of room still so no issues comes with a shower curtain already integrated there's a power fan and talking about the power fan folks there's a button to turn it on actually let me just do this first there's a, a switch on the wall to turn the fan and the lights on very nicely done and it's not a very long hallway, but they actually put a window in here. Let the lights in. It's kind of nice. The bedroom at the front. Uh, European King or RV King, 72 inch wide. Comes with a designer bedspread and sham. A little night table on each side with a power outlet. And on one side you get a USB outlet. Very nice. The front, you get a couple of extra hanging closets. And... With this particular floor plan, the addition of a nice little bench with a big back cushion. I'm a big fan. It just feels nice here. You want to take, you know, morning coffee, read a book. It's very comfy. Um, the cabinet on the top, blue lights as well. It's kind of nice. In front of the bed, we have a little bit of an extra storage with a fireplace. Again, it's the same as the one in the living room. It does produce heat. There's a spot for a TV right here. And very important, there's an extra closet beside the bed, extra hanging closet. And to uh, complete the uh, little room is they added a, a Max Air fan. So it's a great little design. It's actually remote control. You control the speed in and out. And uh, it actually is rain sensor. So if it, if it starts raining, it's going to close on its own. Uh, beside that, storage below the bed with access from outside. Her bed base is made out of plywood, which is the same way her floors are construction on those trailers, folks. You get floor joists, 16 inch on center, and then it's decked with plywood. It does not get any better. Folks, I missed a tons of features, so please take a moment and do, uh, read up the little uh, write-up that I have on her website. If you have any questions, just give us a call. Better yet, come and take a look. I think we've done it, folks.